To start off with, I'm going to be outlining how and why erectile difficulties occur. I'll give a little bit of medical information, but I'm going to be linking this to uh, psychological explanation. I'm going to give you an overview of what the DSM has to say about erectile disorder. Um, and then I'm going to define how a psychological approach fits into and is different from a medical approach and a traditional sex therapy approach. I'm then going to look at some typical psychological causes and underpinnings. And within this, I'm going to give you a, a diagram which I've developed to understand how uh, performance anxiety can occur, which I think can be really useful for explaining to clients. I'm then going to outline um, and give you a handout for assessing this issue in particular. Um, this fits well in conjunction with the sexual history handout in the introductory training. And I'm then going to outline how you can approach treatment with this issue. So I'm going to come back again to the performance anxiety model and talk about the different points of intervention. I'll then outline how we can use a CBT approach to address this issue and how that interlinks with sensate, sensate therapy. And then to tie it all together, I've got a video case study and that will give you an opportunity to practice how you might go, um, how you might plan treatment and how you might conduct assessment.